New Arena in Henderson is just months away from opening, but before the doors open at Dollar Loan Center, people who live in that area are pushing for some major changes, which could happen today. 13 Action News reporter Alyssa Bethencourt joins us now live. And Alyssa, we understand you talked to some of those people about their concerns. So uh, what do they tell you? Yeah, Kalina, they're upset about a few things, but ultimately their biggest concern right now is that this arena was built in the middle of a residential neighborhood. Aside from the traffic and congestion that this is going to cause once events start up here, people who live in the area say signs like the one behind me need to come down. They are also pushing for the hours of LED signs and illuminated signs to be reduced because they feel they are extremely distracting and could pose some serious danger to kids and families traveling in this area. John Dalrymple, a member of the Henderson Coalition for Responsible Government, tells me the organization is putting profits before people. Our, our feeling is let's not make it look like a circus. Let's reduce the number of signs. Let's give consideration to its location in a residential community and, and kind of go from there. If you would have put the arena out someplace where it wasn't a residential community, you could find no problem. But you, you got people. This is a working community. This is this is real life out here and we're asking for those accommodations so that it integrates into it. Now Henderson City Council will be voting on this sign plan today. We will bring you an update on this story once a decision is made. I'm live in Henderson this morning. Elizabeth in court 13 action news.